I give a lot of clinics throughout the year, and I usually say, just as an example, uh, it's probably not a real fun thing for me to say to the guy who's organizing the clinic, but I, I usually say, uh, and then in the end I'll tell him I'm just kidding, but I usually say, this clinic stinks compared to the clinic I was at last night. The clinic I was at last night had Steve Kerr speaking, it had Phil Jackson speaking, it had Doc Rivers, it had Tony Robbins, the motivational coach, it had Jack Welsh, the, the former GM, CEO, uh, and, and in it, you guys are sitting on these metal chairs that are so uncomfortable, and those stands this guy has you in, it's incredibly uh, 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 negative. I had a lazy boy, and I had water, I had soda if I wanted, I had popcorn, and then they always say, well, where were you? And I said, I was in my hotel room. I YouTube Pat Riley. Uh, uh, Welch, uh, Tony Robbins, Phil Jack. We can learn every single night that we're at home. Uh, so I would encourage, and my point is this, I would encourage uh, all young coaches, uh, well any age coach, to study other coaches. I probably twice a week, oftentimes three times a week, will just YouTube a coach uh, or Google a coach. For instance, there's a one-hour uh, interview that Pete Carroll did at USC uh, uh, with their uh, uh, graduate-level business school, and it's incredible about teamwork and, and what he did with the Seahawks. Uh, I was just YouTubing one day Nick Saban, and he was, uh, I said, it, it had Nick Saban talking to Booster Group, and I thought, eh, let me just see, you know, what he says. All of a sudden, it came, became an hour, almost an hour long, on leadership and how he runs the program. You can see Steve Kirk and some of the things he did. There's, there's also two other types of people in this world, and this is for all of us adults. There's uh, know-it-alls and there's learn-it-alls. The successful ones are the learn-it-alls. Steve Kerr is a learn-it-all. Doc Rivers is a learn-it-all. Phil Jackson is a learn-it-all. Pat Riley is the consummate. Uh, you talk about a voracious reader. He is one. So, I often say this, the best are the best for a reason. Now, all of us got to figure out what those reasons are.